G'day everyone. Welcome to another edition of Craig's Kitchen Conversations. And I want to readdress my policy and plans for the procurement system, our preferred contractors, because it needs to change. Now, it's been roughly worked out, and I'm still yet to clarify numbers, around a billion dollars a year is what we shell out to maintain the city, to do the work around it. I'm excluding the big projects, the big infrastructure stuff. I'm talking the day-to-day -day maintenance, footpaths, parks, council buildings, your playgrounds, all these little jobs, all these little projects that come through. We need to change that. What we need to do is adhere to this advice that's been thrown at us for two years of buy local, support local. So let's do that by using local contractors to do local work. So what are the benefits? Well, one, we stop shelling out money to the giant corporations who have people in there full time working out the tenders. They know the system. They know how Auckland Council works. And from what I'm hearing, they're part of the system, if you get my drift. We need to change that. So what we've got to do is allow local contractors to be able to easily apply for a job, to put in a tender, to do the work. We can create that network. That's not a big issue. So why aren't we doing it? Well, What's the next step? The next step is making sure that a contractor is up to speed. Health and safety, the services provided, making sure their value for money, and making sure we get the final product that we should be getting. Warranty, quality, safety, all of those aspects. So now we've got that part sorted, what we have to do is say to every contractor in the local areas, if you want council work, put your name forward. If you're not quite at one of those levels that we require, council will help you get there. We're not going to fob you away and say, go away, come back later when you got your act together. We'll say, what help do you need? Is it with the health and safety? Is it with the quality that we require? What services, what levels do you need to be? It's kind of an insourcing system, but not. Now, what we will achieve from this is having less money going out to subcontractors. We'll work directly with the end contractor doing the work. Some projects are going to require the big contractor to do that. That's granted. But a lot of the stuff, that's not required. How cool will it be to have a local contractor repairing your footpath, doing your public toilets, doing your local facilities, mowing your local berms, collecting your local rubbish from the parks and things, um, looking after your beaches, looking after every council entity in your area by a local contractor system. Now, the kicker on this is you know you're going to get quality work for your money, i.e. your rates, because the local contractors will not do a bad job. If they do, well, one, they won't get any more work, and two, their name will be tarnished. So there's going to be pride in the workplace and pride in the results that they do for their own community. We're going to share the wealth around. We're going to make things cheaper to do instead of being subcontracted out and everybody clipping the ticket. We can price check different contractors for the same roles. And yes, they will have to fight each other for the work. Business bringing the price down, keeping the quality up, still sharing the wealth. There's going to be areas where you won't have a particular contractor available to do a certain type of work. So with the local boards helping out to provide this big network of contractors, we can say, don't worry, there's one in the next area or the next one, they can come in. But we don't need what we currently have where contractors are traveling across the entire Auckland region to do things like glass repairs in council buildings. Well, one, that's just wasting gas and emissions, but it's not efficient. It's inefficient. Let's use local people to do local things. Let's make Auckland work a lot better for itself with the people inside Auckland. <sighs> How good will it be? Vote Craig Lord for Mayor. Let's get this happening.